Hey everybody, this is Rido, and we are back to another recording of Goodbye Deponia. Let us continue. So we figured out how to trade between Rufus on the left and Rufus in the middle. Turns out though, Rufus on the right, I was totally on the right track. I've put all the ingredients I needed to do on this bagel to make Cletus vomit, but for some reason it didn't work. What is that supposed to be? <laughs> One guess. It's our ticket to freedom. You will eat this slightly adulterated bagel and then pretend to be sick, which should come naturally. And when they take you to sick bay, I will come forth from my hiding place and save us over my dead body. You will eat the bagel and I will save us. Yeah, actually, why not? I'm kind of hungry anyway. No, wait, was that a trick? Just so you could have my food, you rotter. I'm on to you. <laughs> Give me that bagel. Mmm. <laughs> I'm feeling a little... I think I'm going to... <laughs> what have you done? You idiot. You poisoned me. <laughs> Bravo. Very convincing. Didn't think you had it in you. <laughs> but uh, you better save your method acting for the guard, especially your complexion. It's really good. Hmm. Let's call the guard over. Yoo-hoo, I feel sick. Is that supposed to be me? Who else? Why are you disguising your voice? Oh, trust me. I'm an excellent voice impersonator. What? But, oh, shush. What is it now? If you keep bothering me, I will... What the? You tow rag! What have you done to my nice rug? Off with you to sick bay, right now! <laughs> Damn! Now I have to air out the cell! <laughs> that was easier than I thought. Too bad there wasn't a big chase sequence on jet skis, though. So, why that didn't work is... I think this game just has some bugs in it, or something, like, maybe what I'm doing is I'm pulling up the, uh, clicking on an item and then not quite clicking on the right box, so I'm missing it ever so slightly, would be my guess, uh, but because I missed that, I thought I was just stuck and couldn't go any further, which means, I uh, it just further added to me being stuck in this game and in a lot of places I am stuck I've missed items uh, I looked over the walkthrough like I said I was going to at the end of last recording and it's just this whole thing of yeah there's been several items I've missed because I just didn't see them I really really need the system here where I could at some point push a button and s just highlight all the objects you can click on. Uh, being eagle-eyed is one thing, but this is getting ridiculous, particularly in this very complicated uh, chapter we're in. Let's try putting the toothbrush in the pneumatic to mail something through the tubes, I first need one of these handy capsules. If we get the capsule, let's try a toothbrush on the sleeping Oregonian. If I fart on any toothbrush, it is better be his. So we have the sandbot here. And we have this, and we have the skyline. The Ponya doesn't look half bad from up here. I just realized that I never got the chance to say goodbye. I've always loved pneumatic tube systems, even though they're not suitable for sending large amounts of bread dough. Large amounts of bread dough. Do we talk to this guy? Yeah, sleeping like a baby, which is actually a good thing. So... Oh, we can just walk through this. What terrible! Huh, nothing. I guess the door only opens for the organon. 
What terrible animation that is right there. They just put this bar here. That should not be here at all. Wow. I was 100% certain I couldn't reach any of these areas. This doesn't make much sense if I haven't got the appropriate application form. So we need some application forms. Fortunately, they're right here. Application form 270. Application form A. Medical assistance in case of job-related injuries induced by terminal maintenance work. Reference number Yerk 75. B. A screwdriver, sharp-edged, to be used in terminal maintenance work. Reference number Hola 55. And C. A replacement lead-type Yerk for defective application terminals. Reference number Yerk 122. So if we could figure out how to trade items with our other guy, we could get a Yerk stamp. Is there anything more in this crate? No. Let's see, let's try the application form in the terminal. So far so good. Now, what am I going to apply for? Let's see. We want a replacement Yerk. What? The Yurk isn't working! Of course. Okay, so we gotta fix the terminal typewriter device. So we can't do... So good. Now, what am I gonna apply for? The only thing I can apply for then is the screwdriver. Hola 55. Fair. If we could put this application form in the send something the through the tube mail chute. I first need one of these handy capsules. Handy capsules. And where are the handy capsules? Guess I can't get to those yet, so we'll go to the crawl space. This looks like... Uh, okay, that's a door. I thought we were gonna handle... This is still not fast enough, Open Boss. Ulysses must not get suspicious. I want to be there when he learns that the army he was going to blow up with this filthy planet is on board. And will take over Elysium under my command. But Ulysses isn't stupid, man. He's stupid enough to think that 11,000 Organons will just volunteer to die submissively. Yes, that is stupid. So, when am I getting my copy of the Ascension Codes? Don't be silly, Oppenbot. You will stay here, of course. Oh, yes. 11,000 Organons. So that's what Argus was talking about. <laughs> I don't believe for a moment that he did not save the podium. He's got the Ascension Codes. I've got hurry. He's already bringing his troops aboard. Another problem that I need to take care of later. So... Is he really just saving his own people? Or is he making the Deponians dress up like the Organon? The Organon is already entering the high boat! I've gotta hurry! High boat. Finally, there it is, the last high boat to Elysium. What a sight! Those monsters! Guess I'll just walk this way. Hey, it's the Am Rubbles. I intruding? Rufus, I'm overjoyed to see you. You have come just in time. And who have we here? Another fellow fighter in our battle against oppression? This is Rufus. I told you about him. Wow, really? The Rufus? Now, if that isn't a good omen for our enterprise, I'm Cowboy Dodo. You may know me from the local radio. And here we have Cindy, Hottie, and Cutis. <laughs> <laughs> he remembers our names. <laughs> I don't want to miss a word. 
Okay, listen up, everyone. I'm the head honcho around here, right? So, what do you want me to do? What's the big plan? We are directly above Bailiff Argus's office. We believe that the Ascension Coach are in jail. Therefore, we wanted to lower Cowboy Dodo on a rope, so he could get his hands on them. I understand, with an unusual tolerance. But I'm here now, so move aside and make room for me. <laughs> I like this guy. Why don't we just take a vote? I'm for Rufus. <laughs> I'm for me too. Oy. I just don't know. No, let Cowboy Dodo do it. He's the best man for the job. Mm -hmm. He's the best man, period. And Yanosh votes for me, of course. Well, it's a draw then. But before we get into a fight over this, remember that manning the crank is also an important job. The crank? I'm not your crank ape. Forget it. I demand a new count. Someone is still missing it up. I'll be right back. Ah. So, there's a crank somewhere we need to get. We're going to gain access to the maid bay. We need to get the other Rufus out of the med bay. Outvote Cowboy Dodo. Uh, okay. But we need that crank for the other puzzles. So let's see if we can find it on the screen. Where is the crank? I don't even see it. Pneumatic mail tube, I'll take that. Uh, nope. Uh, screwed down tight. It's impossible to open that pipeline without the right tool. Hmm. The Organon's pneumatic tube system seems to run right through here. Huh. There's a screw that will let you open the pipeline for maintenance. So I could open it if I had a screwdriver, and I could get a screwdriver if I had a, a plastic thing. Cue this hottie, Cindy. And... Janosh. So let's talk to these girls. Would you like to meet a true hero? You bet, but Cowboy Dodo is so superior. Oh, ladies, you know me so well. Oh my god, he spoke to me. Oh, he's so cute when he talks. I think I'm gonna faint. Hmm. So I don't know where Rufus gets off turning his eyes from goal. After all the mess he's put her through, and all the effort he's gone to secure him, I don't think he should be even looking hey, in yeah. the direction of other women. Hello, Rufus! What was the play again? Where are the others? Let's ask that question. Where are the others? If by ushers, you mean Leibold and Gyleth. They are supporting the troops that confront the Organon in town. That sounds like a veritable civil war. That's what it was. When we set out, the situation was already escalating crazy. They've accomplished men's injured as well as exorbitant collateral damage. <laughs> Were there any, uh, you know, casualties? Yes, thousands of casualties. <laughs> <laughs> He's laughing at the dead people. Wait, that isn't as funny as I thought. What is that twerp doing here? Twerp? Who are you calling a twerp? Cowboy Dodo is certainly not a twerp. He's a well-known pop star in these parts. We should be glad that he's supporting our troop. May I borrow your screwdriver? Of course. Wow, that Just was easy. Don't break it, please. Hey, when did I ever break anything that belonged to you? Shes the other day you converted my deep furred fryer into some shoot of cat litter books. Because of that, she seems you were trying to tame and nurse you back to have. So, how am I to deep fry McVean jelly sandwiches? Uh, sorry, I, I, I don't understand a word. A little later, you broke my only banana picker, and my bunk bed, and my potato peeler. Yeah, okay, just, just... You know, I can't make out a word you're saying. I, it's your speech impediment, I know. 
See you later. Please be careful. So, they keep referencing things Rufus does in between chapters, which makes no sense because it seems like all these events happen right back to back. Now that's interesting. The Organon's pneumatic tube system seems to run through here. Maybe I can open this with the screwdriver. This is so hard to bend. I hope it won't be long before they send something. Ouch. Oh, great. So much for the screwdriver. Well, at least I got a capsule out of it. Let's see what the Organon has written. Attention all ranks. Be careful around the open ends of the pneumatic tubes. <laughs> Those idiots. Okay. So I think hey, that... wait a minute. What was that all about, huh? Are you serious about taking me on? In case you still don't get it, this is my show. Cowboy Dodo saves the world. Yeah, right, and they're giving away nail clippers and pollution. I founded the Resistance. I uncovered the plans of the Organon, and I will be the one who saves the world. <laughs> I knew it. This is all about your ego, isn't it? Yeah, yeah my ego is determined to save the world. Oh, yeah? Then why do you refuse to turn the crank? Because... I'm... Um... You'd better make up your mind, buddy. If you want the world to be saved, then come on back in and let me save the world. But if you're only doing this to look like a hero, then we got a problem. I have a certain image to uphold, you know? And I'm not about to let some local hit peel the crust up my swill. We'll see about that. Is that supposed to be a threat? <laughs> Just look at you, you scrawny wimp. <laughs> I can take on two of you hands down. Is that so? In that case, we should try it out. Wait here. Don't go away. So it doesn't seem like I can even go back until later. Until I get two guys. Well, okay. Application form in the pneumatic mail carriage. Pneumatic mail carriage in the mail chute. Oh, so exciting! Whoa! That went fast. <laughs> Yes! That's actually the screwdriver I ordered for myself. Hmm. Based on the description in the application form, I had assumed it would be a little bigger. That's the last time I order anything from those frauds. So, screwdriver in the door sensor? Because that makes sense. <laughs> what kind of handyman would I be if I couldn't outwit a cheap door sensor? <laughs> <laughs> a super handyman would never try to disable a sophisticated high security sensor without the right equipment. Hmm. So, we need another application form, I assume. And then we need the yurt. Which means we need to go over to the skyline and we need to go over here so there's this flyer here I haven't picked up one of the many things I've not picked up hmm. that ah I see you are interested in our flyer <laughs> Very much so. Excellent! You'll find all the important information on our products in there. There's even a small preview of the upcoming winter fashions on the back. If you are subject to winter depression, you should act now. Many models are out of stock during the holidays. <laughs> um, what are you doing? Well, I'm making a paper airplane. What else? But my beautiful flyer! Well, we'll see if it's a beautiful flyer in the test flight. So, it's a dumb pun. <laughs> again so we have now the flyer flyer Mo's therapeutic ropes 
the cheaper alternative. Well, will you look at that? Apparently, the knot will be worn more to the left in the upcoming season. So now we need another item that's over here. The metal type yerk to give to this guy. And I think you probably have figured out what we're going to do. It's really stupid, but we're going to do it. Of course. If you make the nose of a paper airplane heavier with a weight, it'll fly farther. I knew my long career as a parking offender would eventually pay off. And we now take this weighted flyer and we fly it to the upper section. I could make a stage. terrific paper airplane out of this flyer. On the other hand, the information in there could make somebody's life a lot easier. Maybe I'll find a way to combine business and pleasure, like with my homemade massage chair. But this time, I'll leave out the ejector seat function. Hmm. Well, that should have worked. I could make a terrific paper. On the other hand, maybe I'll find like with my home. But this time, I don't know. That's what I'm supposed to do, but I'm also supposed to do this. Give this to Sergeant Bambi. They'll use that for the new tattoo, hopefully. And then they will. I found verify. the right design for your unit. Here. Hey, that's not bad. That looks sort of fierce. <laughs> you can say that again. A fierce magic elf, you cupcakes. Whatever it is, you found the right design for our squad insignia. Now we can get started. Are you sure you want to watch? Getting a tattoo isn't for sensitive souls! Sensitive souls? <laughs> the very nerve. As you wish. Sensitive souls. Pfft, I don't believe it. I've jammed hot needles in parts of my body that... you know it was so boring I just fell asleep ding again so where are we what it find the proper squad emblem convince Bambi and convince Lodi to vouch for me shouldn't be too difficult Hey, Lottie, can you come to the gate now to identify me? No, I can't right now. I have to wait until the swelling on my tattoo goes down. Uh, yes, but I said... No! Mm. Take the deck can chair. Can I take this deck chair? Sure. I mean, sure. You need to get... Do you need the instructions? Never. A marine doesn't need instructions. Suit yourself. Suit yourself. <laughs> Is there anything new to click on over here? Doesn't seem like it, so let's go into this caravan, I suppose. Hey, no access for civilians. I'm not a civilian. I'm part of the resistance. Which, by the way, is also why you were going to accompany me to the gate. Well, tough luck. I have new orders. I'm supposed to guard the radio and bring in any messages from the front. Well, I've got a message here. From the frontmost front. I have to get into the rebel camp. And fronto, a pronto. Then talk to the major. She sets the priorities here. Yeah, you bet I'm going to. Wait a second. That's no major. That's just Tony. No, Major T. Th th that's my ex-girlfriend. I see she's moving up in the world. Not just professionally. goat. I so <sighs> let's open the locker door. Grab the lunchbox. See what's in the lunchbox. Well then, let's see what Lottie has in her lunchbox. What is that? Lottie didn't take her hormones. Maybe the fortune teller was right after all. Hormones in deck chair. Let's see. 
is this cowboy dodo. Again, we have a bar here that seems like it would be separating the area. And I thought this was the door into this area, but no. Just walk. Surprise. Rufus, good to see you. Yeah, yeah, and your mother smells of... What? It's what to see me? Good. Yeah. I was afraid something had happened to you. Hey, something's different. You got a new hairstyle. Close. A new therapist. Ah, uh, therapy. It seems to have done wonders for Tony's complexion. Probably too relaxed and too chill now. Is there anything else we have to click on in this area? I don't think so. Notice how he sits backwards so we can see both faces. You, Tony! Ah, oh, Rufus. Won't you sit down? I need to talk to this new general. Can you take me through the gate? I could. But I won't. I need to finish my meditation first. Excuse me, does that mean you're just gonna sit here? The Organon might be initiating the detonation of our planet at this very moment. While the last high boat is still anchored at Ascension Customs? Unlikely. Unlikely, unlikely. Will you still be saying that when everything around here suddenly turns into a, a, a flaming fiasco? Oh, uh, now that was highly unlikely. You mean like back when you tried to turn lead into brass instruments? That was a completely <laughs> different matter. Anyway. It would have worked if only I hit the high F sharp. Poor oh, Rufus, just relax. We've got everything under control here. The general has a plan. So the general has a plan? What kind of plan could that what possibly be plan? if it doesn't involve me? That's a secret. But I'm the leader. You used to be the leader. We have a new general now. New general, new schmeneral. Mo, mo, mo. You don't even have a war anymore. I mean, where's all the action? The explosions? The dismembered people? The burning huts? As I said, we have a new general now. Come on, Tony. I just want to get into the camp. And I say, you had better stay out of it. We've got everything under control here. And what, what's the deal with that secret plan? That's a secret. Yeah, you don't expect me to, <laughs> to tell me swallow anything. that. Why not? You swallowed an entire liter of paint thinner, and everybody knows that stuff causes immediate brain damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was cool. Things seem to be different with the resistance these days. Thank you. That wasn't a compliment. Everything here is... So organized, boring, lame, dreary. I guess that's because we drove the Organon out of Port of Fisco. We have new equipment and new command structures. Excuse me, I can barely hear you. Your mechanical beard is making too much noise. So, you found yourself a new therapist. So, you found yourself a new therapist? Yes, and he is really good. For one thing, I no longer have this recurring nightmare where I'm being chased by a GNU, where the walls are dissolving around me until the whole house collapses on top of me. Yeah, that was quite a memorable day. And you must admit that the gate really stopped squeaking after that. Hmm. How can you just sit here totally unperturbed? The world is coming to an end. Does that mean you ran out of your famous plans? Oh, of course I have a plan. But for that, I need, you know... Help? A minimum of support. Remember, it's me who's saving everyone's fat, lazy behinds around here. <laughs> In that case, let me thank you. But there's no need for you to save us. We've got a plan of our own now. If you want to help us, just sit somewhere and don't touch anything that flashes. Or is in any way combustible. Or yellow. Oh, you know what? Don't touch anything at all. 
Come on, death to the Organon and all that. Come on, death to the Organon and all that. I know that you mean it, but there's no need for you to save us. We've got a plan of our own now. If you want to help us, just sit somewhere and don't touch anything that flashes. I know exactly how I can draw out the old pony. Spare yourself the effort. <laughs> you should know me better than that. When have I ever made an effort? Let's go through all these. Why not? Do you remember how I used your grandmother's urn as a pudding bowl? I'm sure you had your reasons. Yeah, but the, the thing is... That wasn't pudding at all. <laughs> hey, that's really a good answer to the question where that funky smell came from. Thanks for letting me know. Do you remember how I tried to teach Mr. Woofy to fly? Yes, I certainly do. And I apologize if my reaction back then was a bit over the top. I just couldn't control my fists or my brass knuckles. Yeah, but you don't even know the best part. A week later, it worked after all. <laughs> and the story about Mr. Woofy being hit by a falling weather balloon is only half true, you know. What? Now that's a relief. In that case, my reaction was completely appropriate. <laughs> Do you remember how I secretly took photos of your mother in the bathroom? Yeah, but I never understood why. Because I never told you that I sold the pictures to old ogling Aussie. <laughs> of course, I had to throw in some, um, you know, underpants, or I couldn't have afforded the sticker out. You are such a prankster. Always good for a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, she must be very heavily medicated. I have risen from the dead. Congratulations. Doesn't that scare you at all? Rufus, there was so many times when you blew yourself up, set yourself on fire, sawed into your leg, or got trampled by stampeding buffalo. You really have to come up with some new tricks if you want to impress me. Aww. There's three of me now. All right. Now that is impressive, but also totally absurd. But it's true. I cloned myself. I think we would have noticed by now, from the reign of ash or some such thing. There's three of me, honestly. Ooh, boring. Oh, I give up. You do? Oh, remind me to send my therapist a fruit basket. It's not over yet. What isn't over yet? Uh, no, well, it's over. But I'll be back. No rush. So let's try the, let's, these hormones. Bonnie didn't take her hormones. Maybe the fortune teller was right after all. Let's see if that works on Tony. Pouring oil on a fire is one of my favorite pastimes. But in this case, eh, I may as well just go back on the conveyor belt. Well, let's give Lottie the hormones then. Lottie didn't take her hormones. Maybe the fortune teller was right after all. What was the fortune teller? What did he say about hormones? Lottie didn't take her hormones. Maybe the fortune teller was right after all. Deck chair. Deck chair on this. There's something stuck to the tip. A capital yerk. Whoever made this obviously had no idea how to fold a proper paper airplane. Deck chair. A baby bozo? That doesn't make any sense. I could easily throw that far. But as long as there's nobody there who can catch as well as I can, it'd be pretty pointless. Weighted flyer on Baby Bowser? I could make a terrific paper airplane out of this flyer. On the other hand, the information in there could make somebody's life a lot easier. Maybe I'll find a way to combine business and pleasure. Like with my homemade... But this time, 
Homemade massage chair with ejector seat. Let's see. Let's go to give the flyer to maybe the mooks. Those old fogies aren't getting anything from me. According to the intergenerational contracts, they still owe me a complete education, flute lessons, and a clean planet. But I'd be happy to have a sports car instead. I would be happy if point-and-click adventure games just uh, didn't repeat themselves after a while. Just made a uh-uh sound or something. Just a buzzer. All right. So weighted flyer to the mailman? Don't want to make him cranky. <laughs> to I may have found the right treatment for Bozo. If it's a rope. I already offered it back. He didn't want it. <laughs> oh. Well, then I'll keep looking. I may have found the right treatment for Bozo. If it's a rope, I already offered it back. He didn't want it. <laughs> oh. Well, then I'll keep looking. Hormone. On Mama there Bozo? are far too many hormones floating around here already. Did you take your pills today? Why do you want to know? You a narc? <laughs> of course not. That's a relief. At my age, it gets harder and harder to cheat on a urine test. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty funny. Don't want to make him cranky. <laughs> Let's see. What if we go up to Bozo and give him the pills? Will this work? Better not. I don't like thinking about that fiasco with my hormone case. Bozo is just a terrible when he's got PMS. Hmm. So, maybe I give the hormones to this lady. Can I trade you some interesting knickknacks for a burrito? A burrito wrap costs 125 glottis. But until I get a new seat. Alright, so it doesn't seem like any of the things we have right now are going to solve that. Let's go over to left. Thing. So by reading the uh, walkthrough, I sort of know what I missed here, and it's another just point and click thing where we look at I this. I hereby declare that my search for the missing link between humans and monkeys is ended because I really don't want to be descended from him. Let's see. We're trying to get his hat. Believe. <laughs> oop, oop yourself. Hmm. Crank release button. Huh. No crank to be released. We want the crank. Oh, can and I can also offer you some barely used children. Save your breath. The show costs five lives. Go on. You know the game. Shoot. Let's try this sign again on Goon and June. I can help find you a job. Go top of yourself. There are only five slotties in all of the sewers, so my occasional performances in the pub are completely sufficient. Say what? You started a solo career? Mm. But we were going somewhere with our band. But that is how this works. We want the space heater. Uh, can I borrow the uh, space heater? Well, you know, it's pretty cold here, but if it isn't too long. Uh, June, uh, let me handle this, all right? What do you need it for, Rufus? Well, you know, I, I thought, uh... Oh, I just remembered that the warranty will be void if we lend it to you. 
Sorry, Rufus. Perhaps some other time. Let's talk to him again. Hello, you two turtle doves. <laughs> uh oh. Hello, Rufus. I insist on doing you. A favor. I insist on doing you a favor. No, Rufus, that really isn't necessary. We're happy the way we are. <laughs> yes, yeah, sure. Happy in the gutter. <laughs> you jokers. <laughs> Seriously, I have already got a couple of ideas about how I can radically improve your lives. Radical? Oh, hell! <laughs> what are you planning? <laughs> I'm not telling. Let it be a surprise. Oh, isn't that exciting, Goo? Goo, are you traveling? Oh. <laughs> be seeing ya! Please, at least give us time to find hard hats. Goon. So I don't understand what we're missing here. Let's see. I'm supposed to take the sign and give it to this I can help find you a job. No, top to R on some my case. Say what? But we were going... And... Go to our middle guy and give this to this guy. Give this to this guy and is there any wet reason why I'd have this here? No, nope, I don't see a reason. Find something to counter the cold and darkness. Obtain the radiator from Gun and Jin. Help Gun and Jin get the re get rewarded for that. Hmm. Subdue Cowboy Dodo is now needed. I've kind of missed gain access to the medical bay. Give the deck chair to go. I can help you renovate this place. Please don't. We've only just got it the way we want it. All right. So you want me to surprise you? That's fine. I'll just wait until you're both asleep. No, Rufus. Okay. Fine. I completely understand. I can still hang my things up to dry when all my plans to save the world have gone down the drain. Uh, let's. Try it on the but it's this cream. garbage, I couldn't even open a cardboard box. I need some real tools. Real tools. Let's you can't negotiate with people like that. They only know one language. Fisticuffian. Let's give this to the monkey. I have to keep an eye on my things. Organ grinders monkeys are often trained to be little pickpockets. Everyone knows that. Do we use this on the run? For this, I need nothing but my fingers and my acrobatic skills. Let's see. This. On I the have monkey. to keep an eye on my organ grinder. This on the organ grinder. I may not have five, but I've got Savior. The show called. Well, let's try giving the hormones to the monkey then. You should consider changing careers. I know. Unfortunately, there are practically no job offers for certified hand models right now. You know, actually, I was thinking of, um, you know, being a test subject for experimental drugs. Been there, done that, got the t-shirt. <laughs> yeah, now that you mention it. How about the hormones you can't negotiate the with people like that. They only know one language. Fisticuffian. I may not have five, but I've got a show. Okay. Did I offer the hormones to? Go on. You know the game. Shoot. 
Let's see. Did I offer the hormones to go in and Shit, that's not going to improve their sad lives as social outcasts. Nope. That doesn't work. We'll go here. Again. Let's go back and talk to the bottle witch. Hormones. It's a bottle. Do bottle collectors have health insurance? That depends on whether you're a salaried employee or a freelancer. <laughs> Hello again, unfair Talk lady. Talk to her again. Uh, the young father is back. Oh, I can tell him about the dancing monkey. There actually is a dancing monkey. You mean the organ grinder's monkey? I've seen it. It's a miserable monkey. It can't even dance. I'll keep my money. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. Tasty little children. I already told you, I'm not interested in your brats. If I wanted to, I could have a whole brain silo full of the things. But I decided to pursue a career instead. Why exactly do you need the five Slotties? I'm keeping them. I love it when people make monkeys of themselves for me. <laughs> I've got to go. But why? We were just having fun and... Uh, uh, wait a moment. Did the water here just get warmer? Like I said, <laughs> I've got to go. Ciao. Let's see. Aren't you going to look for a real job at some point? Real job? Huh. What's your line of work? Well, I'm, I'm an inventor. An inventor of excuses, perhaps. Yeah, the best one in the southeast quadrant. <laughs> okay, to the leper colony to go back. Maybe I put this... ...sign... ...here. Try it with the organ grinder and the. Oh, here's a jack. The hero checks his inventory and sees the crank is missing. <laughs> so. There's something missing from this jack. It's something know, like a crank handle, and it should fit exactly into this crank hole. What could it be? Was there something else? I just haven't clicked on at all. I mean, we... I understand everything. Let's see. Try this on the organ grinder. I may not have five Zlotties, but I've got... Nope, it's not going to work. Try this on the monkey. You should consider changing careers. I know. Unfortunately, there are practically no job offers for certified hand bottles right now. You know, actually, I was thinking of, um, you know, being a test subject for experimental drugs. Been there, done that, got the t-shirt. <laughs> yeah, now that you mention it. That's strange. I hereby declare that my search for the missing link between humans and monkeys. Because I really don't... <laughs> Pack it out. Is the trick I have to be up here? <laughs> and then I can grab his hat. You know the game. Shoo. I hereby declare that my have I really isn't all that they're at so we have the pipe forest we need the space heater are these mushrooms just jokes or is this a kind of combination <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. So 
we have these five mushrooms, which I don't think are just a trap. <laughs> Ouch. This one releases nothing. Ouch. So then can we talk Hello to the again, Lich? unfair lady? The ah, young I've gotta go. But why? We wait a moment in the water. Here. Like I said, ciao. Hello again, unfair. No, 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 no. I don't want to talk to her again. But why? We would just have wait a moment in the Come water. On. Like I said, I've got to go. Ciao. Is there anything else on this scene to click on? Any other mushrooms? Do we talk to Rusty, perhaps? There are four things. Maybe we can get the kids to get the mushrooms. This just won't work. Uncle Rufus needs to go to the pub. The fate of the whole world depends upon it. Also, he's thirsty. No, leave us alone. No, leave us alone. You can't keep following me forever. Don't you ever get tired? Well, it's way past our bedtime. All right then, go take a long nap. And where exactly should we sleep? Hey, that's not my problem. Oh, yes it is. Either you tuck us in nice and cozy, or we'll just keep following you. Oh. <sighs> Here's plenty of room where you can sleep. What, here? We're in water up to our necks. Oh, oh making demands, are you? No wonder your parents abandoned you. So we have the campsite, we have the lantern, we have all these mushrooms, we have, it doesn't seem like any item that would make any sense. We tried to give the hormones to her. Who came up with that? I didn't find death all that restful. We could give the thing to the bottle witch. I've got a one-of-a-kind investment option for someone who happens to have five Zloty. Why invest? Well, you know, because of uh, added value. Added value? But these five Zlotties are all there is, and they're already mine. Oh, yeah. In the leather... I've got a one-of-a-kind investment Doesn't option make for sense. someone who... Why in well, you know, be... But be and there... Oh... And there's nothing over here, right? Even if I could get to this window. It's such a nice day outside, and I'm hanging out in the sewer. If I could open this bars, I think I could walk up here and actually get to that window. But I just don't feel like that is part of the solution right now. something here. I'm definitely missing something. Let's look at the skyline. And before we look at the skyline though, let's go back and go here and look at that the upper ascension the station. Upper ascension station. Somewhere up there. The last high boat to Elysium is waiting. So, look at the sky. Mm. Everything should be in order. I could make a terrific paper airplane out of this flyer. On the other hand, the information in there could make somebody's life a lot easier. Maybe. 
maybe I'll find a way to combine business life? and pleasure, like with my homemade massage chair. But this time, I'll leave out the ejector seat function. Let's try to give the flyer to everybody, I guess. Lottie may have worked in City Hall for years, but she still can't be bribed. That seems paradoxical, but maybe it's like with hospital germs. Let's give this to Sergeant What's Mandy. that you've got? Is that a message from the front? Not exactly. Then I'm not interested. A message from the front. All right. We can get one of those. We'll take this, give this to him, go back. We will take this letter. What's that you've got? Is that a message from the front? No less. Not from Bozo by any chance. <laughs> would I lie to you about such an important topic? Or would I leave the conclusion to your imagination in the hope that it might by chance help me out? Yeah, enough with the fancy <laughs> schmancy. Give me the letter. Well, she opened the letter for us. My dearest honey bunch. Huh. Are you sure this letter is for me? Bambi. Honey. Makes sense. Some people get poetic when they're mortally wounded. What? Ah, sorry. I didn't mean to jump the gun. Wait. Dearest honey bunch, uh, I wish you were here with me. Blah, 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 blah. To be more exact, I stepped on an organon landmine. Oh, no. Bozo. Is he all right? Well... Is he still alive? Tell me! Or do I have to pull the information out of you in the form of your brain tissue through your nose? Hey, hey, stay calm. No reason to get aggressive right away. I'm just a mailman. Bozo is with his family. You should set out right away. Wait, there's more. Watch out for the mailman? Oh, no, the small print isn't that important. Go on. You're losing valuable time. Right. I need to be by his side. Hang on, Bozo. I'm coming. <laughs> that was easy, and I didn't even have to lie. Presenting the new and improved Rufus. Forget the Rufus you once knew. <laughs> okay, so can I hit some buttons now? Well, it doesn't seem like I can. Oddly enough, it does not seem like any of those things mattered. Let's give this to There's something Tony. stuck to the tip. A capital Yurk. Whoever made this obviously has no idea how to fold a proper paper airplane. Let's give this to Tony. What's that supposed to be? This is, <laughs> you won't believe it, <laughs> an alternative to your therapy. Sweet of you to want to help me, but I am satisfied with my therapy. Well, aren't you at least going to read the flyer? No thanks. My therapist says I'm making great strides, and I trust them completely. Ow. So, we got Bambi to the house, which is going to give us several new items, I suspect. Fact, when we get back to the Bozo's house, uh, which will, I believe, start opening the path a little bit better. We've hit this choke point, definitely, right now, where I'm almost to the point where I'm going to want to check the walkthrough yet again, but I won't do it in between this episode and the next, because I think with that one lucky break we might start clearing the field of all the junk maneuvers and being only and start narrowing down the actual good maneuvers as always i ask you to like share subscribe comment if you want to and watch every second of my videos all that helps me out if you want to support support me you can click on my name righto on the right will be a blue button that says support this channel. Click it, make a donation. And if you want a friend or follow me on basically any social media, there's a whole bunch of links down below. Thank you for watching. Have a good evening.